<laughs> Jed needs to show some leadership. Here, here. Carson Wentz has more wins at Levi's in the last two seasons than the Niners. Clean house. Ooh, that is true. That is true. That is when you put it that way. God. Uh, was this the first time Niner fans booed in a game while in the Banana Hand era? I believe so. I think it and was. And I, I think the boos were well deserved because I, I, I don't know what else you're supposed to do. I mean, that was a they, they've been patient. The, the faithful have been patient uh, with Kyle. Uh, David says after the first six games, two things are obvious. No all 22 analysis needed. One, 21 Niners are no better than the 20 team. They are poorly coached. I'd have to agree with David on that. I think the 20 team was better than the 21 team, to be honest with you. Thank you. Thank you. That team was 43. The 20 team had uh, game plans where, like, if you go look at the Patriots game plan, that was a whoa. Like, wow, Kyle Shanahan just – that's you true. look at the Rams game plans. You look at what Robert Sala was doing with the Rams game plans. You look at the Cardinals game plan to win with CJ Beathard. Yeah. Kyle showed some what savvy, is, took a knee before half. done that's okay. impressive. My bad. You were timing out for a second. Kyle showed some savvy, what? took a knee before half when the Colts were causing turnovers. Also let Debo return punts and kicks. I don't know. Uh, Debo returned kicks. That's why he got, he got booed. He took that. He took that, that yeah. That's why he got booed. Hunter says trade Trent Wayne for the Chiefs. I I kind of, you know, I kind of I see the booze, but I, I thought Rodney Harrison summed it up best. By the way, the PFT, the I've never watched the NBC post game, where Rodney Harrison, Chris Sims, Jack Collinsworth, it's actually a really good show. I thought they summed it up best. And I think this sums up the Kyle Shanahan coaching experience to the T. Frank Wright coached like a coach and Carson Wentz played like a quarterback who no matter what he knew that his head coach believed in him. Yeah. And that, yeah. that's why they kept continuing to take shots down the field in spite of Carson Wentz playing horrific for the first half of this game. He played worse than Jimmy Garoppolo played at any point in this game in the first quarter. He almost four picks Emmanuel Mosley himself that's and true. by himself. True. And Frank Reich stood by him. And Kyle Shanahan coached like a coach that has zero faith and trust in his quarterback. And I think having zero faith and trust in his quarterback and not empowering his quarterback, something we talked yeah. about about when we were dis- uh, talking about the distinction between Andy Reid and Kyle Shanahan, maybe six months ago, we were talking about how Kyle Shanahan doesn't imp- it maximizes his quarterbacks. Andy Reid empowers his quarterbacks. And I, I thought that was a sim- – Rodney Harrison seemed to think that was the symptom of the 49ers losing, and that's why Frank Wright called a better game in those terrible situational circumstances, given that they were playing in a monsoon. And I, I couldn't say-, say it better myself. Eugene, thank you for the $10. Appreciate you. Jason, you're leading us into our next topic. OBJ for Ayuk, since Shanahan and Lynch are done with Brandon Ayuk. Uh, if the Niners trade Ayuk before they trade Garoppolo, I wonder how the Niner fans would re- respond. 